this is going to be a love reading for all signs, you and your person of interest. And we're going to do the sun signs on this side and then the person of interest on this side. Okay, so let's get started. Aries. <laughs> all right you're setting the tone here aries this is my free willy card <laughs> oh my gosh okay <laughs> that was, that just shocked me out of the room for a minute there <laughs> oh lordy okay all right <laughs> Okay, so, uh, and they, your, your uh, person of interest is watching you. Look at that. Ooh. <laughs> but I feel like it's a spiritual person. Okay, it is a snow leopard. Okay, all right. <laughs> okay, yeah, that goes on this side here. Okay. So I feel like on the airy side here, okay, you're ready to kind of um, explore maybe uh, your sexuality at some some people. Okay, now here it says song lists. So um, music might be inspirational to you, okay, in whatever you do, okay. Uh, maybe some of you have achieved a high status with music somehow with this lioness card. Okay, so Venus is really, I feel like, um, uh, kind of assisting with those energies when it comes to love and money. So this is a nice time for change and union, okay, if you plan on doing it. Okay, so... Uh, <laughs> There's a play on words there. Okay. <laughs> I'm trying to concentrate. Okay. All right. Okay. So, okay. So on this side, I feel like if you're watching them, they're kind of mi mirroring this. Uh, it's like a calling energy. I feel like it's like calling you to make change in your life. And I feel like that's like um, improvement. But uh, that may feel like a big shift or a big jump to actually bring this into union on this side because uh, there's that line. So that could be like uh, strength energy where you, you might be a little guarded there. But I feel like the call is to reach beyond whatever that is of I feel like if you go this way, it's just going to be in territory. It's like that Uranus energy again. Territory unknown, and it feels unfamiliar. So uh, in 2022, uh, it's suggesting that you uh, uh, make this mood I, move. Okay, so the thing to do is find out where your... Um, when you hang out with your family, find out what are your points of extreme fire energy. And if you can know that and watch out for it, I feel like you could have success here. Okay. Let's get these. Soft whispers. Okay. Let's read that one. Okay. All right, so proclaiming love affirmation. I speak softly and my voice is filled with love. I say all the right things and make the world melt. Ooh, that sounds sexy. <laughs> okay, meditation, being love. Do you hold a loving tone? Oh, that's interesting because this is a song. Okay. Okay, so do you hold a loving tone? Try to speak soft and sweet things only, even just for a day. 
I had to do that. I didn't really have a choice a couple of days there. <laughs> okay, but um, so that's the suggestion to practice your smooth jazz voice. <laughs> okay, <laughs> next. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> All right, let's see here. Ooh, the unexpected. Ooh, yeah. Okay, so that's Uranus. Be ready. I think I did a, re a reading like that. Okay. Oh, that's on this side. Sea turtle. Okay. All right. So <clears throat> I'm picking up on, for some of you, there may be a little bit of fear when it comes to uh, reaching into a new rela relationship, right? Okay. So, but I feel like there's a strong call in the physical reality here with this deer car. What does it say down here? power okay so some of you have just been working on you I feel like in increasing your uh, vibration and spending time with family or children okay and <clears throat> but I feel like there's a deep desire there to reach beyond okay and that could be the Uranus energy okay so I feel like that's the calling, right? Okay, it's almost like here she is, and there's a deer in the background, like there's a, a come hither kind of like calling. Okay. All right, so, but on their side, there is, a, I feel like Venus energy here. Love and uh, willingness to offer uh, stability to you. Okay. And that's what you like. Okay, so sea turtle and sea ability. But what you definitely want is someone who is peaceful. And uh, <clears throat> I get a serene feeling with your person. So I feel like this would be a very nice union. Okay, so. So even though you might be suppressing coming together with someone, the call is there. That's what I'm picking up with that. Okay, so what to do about that? Hmm. Okay, just move in your truth. Uh, it's like, make the moves, but let the person know exactly what it is you desire, okay, in a partnership ahead of time. I feel like that's very important, okay, and I feel like that would be the success, that positive c communication and interaction, okay, yeah. All right, let's see. Erotic bliss. <laughs> yep. Okay, so. All right, so that could be some of the Aries. Some of you, if you're cusping with Aries, that could have been some of that. <laughs> okay. They have free willy card first out. <laughs> okay. Okay. All right, so 17. Okay. <clears throat> Seeing love, the love story. Too long, they have fought against it. And I feel like that's what's been going on with a lot of Torians. It's like withholding or something. Okay. Too long they had held out. Too long they had held themselves back. And now these beautiful and empowered lusty vixens uh, took things into their own hands, quite literally. And the result was pure, orgasmic, erotic bliss. <clears throat> 
They establish a holy and pure, uninhibited space for beauty, for ecstasy, for passion, for love. Truly, heaven is a place on earth. As above, so below, and down lower and lower and lower. <laughs> oh, Lordy. Okay. All right. So, making love. Action. Make space in your life for your own version of orgasmic bliss. Whatever that looks like. Shed any notions of shame or judgment as you pursue pleasure and manifest your climax. Make sure your journey is just as you like it. On your own terms. Uh, meditation. Meditate on the nature of erotic and orgasmic bliss. Take the moment to <clears throat> appreciate those heavenly energies which, with gratitude. Affirmation. My life is orgasmic. I live in bliss and harmony. Okay, thank you, Taurus. Let's go on to the next one. Okay, Gemini. Okay, I don't know why over here I got Dancing of the Maypole or something like that. So it's like, I feel like on the Gemini side, you want to bring a freshness, a newness to uh, whether this is an old relationship or a new relationship. You want to bring that freshness and newness, I feel like, like spring. Okay, <clears throat> and within the relation relationship dynamic if you've been with this person for a while I feel like you want to bring back that uh, deep attraction you had when you first came together okay <clears throat> all right so that's on this side and I feel like that's masculine energy okay so um, on this side is protection and sea otter so I feel like this could be a man or a woman uh, with kind of like that feminine energy okay all right so and I feel like on this side they want security and protection so that would equate into the dollar sign that doesn't sound very romantic but uh, that's what it boil it boils down to is Want to feel safe and secure and loved deeply. And so it's like they don't mind engaging in like a sexual connection here, but it has to be deeper than just, you know, um, wham, bam, thank you, man. Man? Ma'am? Hold on. Wham, bam, thank you, ma'am or man. <laughs> okay. <clears throat> oh, that got me choked up. Okay, so it's like they want that, you know, that deeper thing where you like look into their eyes and connect to their soul kind of love. That's what this side wants. Okay, so. Okay, and a playful kind of love. So it's like bring that playfulness back. Okay, that's what I feel like it's calling for. All right, let's see. What's the middle card? The sweetest taboo. Okay, let's see what that's about. Okay. All right, so here it says, two lovers separated by what seem like insurmountable odds, their family, society, circumstances. None of that mattered when uh, they had their first kiss. 
All obstacles faded into nothingness as they bit deeply into forbidden fruit as the sweet nectar led them along a journey of bliss. They slashed every taboo, tried every angle. It all began with that one juicy kiss. All right, making love, action. Follow your taboo. Do something today that scares you or perhaps just something that scares everyone else. <laughs> I don't know about that. <laughs> okay, Follow your heart's desire and uh, indulge in decadence, whether it's something as simple as extra large slice of cake or something more. Pursue your pleasure and fulfill your every need. Today is the day. Okay. Uh, being love. Meditation. Deep down inside, what do you desire? Visualize yourself plucking that wish down from the tree and holding it in your hands. Proclaiming love, affirmation. I indulge in my passions and follow my heart. I am filled with love and boundlessness. Okay, thank you, Gemini. I'm going to do a separate video for the uh, next three.